good people how are you welcome back to my youtube channel and this is part two of magandi like magandi the, my excursion in magandi is where i am today i've done already part two and i want to show you where we are now this part two this is a uh, this white thing you can see here is is soda ash bicarbonate of soda imagine very impressive we just have a look uh, closely imagine and it is a, a natural commodity that is harvested here in lake magandi so there is this side i, I showed you in part one that, that that is where they have the salt and then this other side of the lake they harvest the soda ash bicarbonate or soda and imagine they have a factory over there yeah you can see a factory those buildings there that's a factory for the soda ash and then for the the salt is the other side so they they take it there and then no yeah and then before then also they take it in um from the factory they take it to mobasa and to other places for refining and then you can see even it is already packed in bags yeah in bags like that those those blue bags over there yeah so they are and then it is taken to the factory mostly to Mobasa and to many other places through uh, they, they go by they go by train that we have seen somewhere there are all those heaps of, of nini looking like like his sword no like he, like his soil is a uh, soda ash and then the guide is explained to us that uh, the soda ash is very important in the country and in the whole world it's a natural commodity that is very very important it is used for preserving especially food all kinds of food you know like like beer uh, like like uh, like uh, be okay beer bread you know all those things they are used oh, it's the soda ash is the, when it is is fine and separated into different or whatever it is uh, used for preserve preserving food yes so this is very impressive it's a very nice place to be to come and enjoy yourselves especially you kenyans just come magandi is not very far from nairobi you can come and see for yourself what i am seeing here that is a factory that is operated by the indians over there and it is doing very well and they, they work 24 7 from monday to sunday they work in shifts so this is all magandi this area they harvest mostly the soda ash the one you can see here then there is another area there the way i showed you in part one of this of this uh, video they harvest they harvest uh, salt yeah that is how it is very beautiful i mean it's a very interesting place to come yeah very interesting place to come to see what happens here so let me show you the soda the soda ash closely the lake it looks dry but it's not dry yeah this is this side it looks blackish before it is harvested it looks like that you see that is a lake over there so they can they come to harvest with them um, with some a kind of machine and then it is put over there to dry and then afterwards it's packed in bags yes so wait for this is part two wait for party part three we are still on a excursion and seeing many other places in this area very interesting place to be and it's very worthwhile to come and visit, especially the Kenyans. And the ones from abroad, from US, from India, from all over the country, if you get a chance to come to Kenya, just make sure you come to Magandi. Yes, it's not very far from Nairobi, from Nairobi city. And you see many beautiful things, many natural beautiful things that you have never seen there. There is a tractor. For, her, for collecting and putting together the soda ash. All those heaps, they look like, it looks like, like it's sand, but it is soda ash, bicarbonate of soda. Yeah. Okay, so for now, that's all. Wait for now, party three to come is on the way. Bye, see you. Thank you very much for watching my videos. Thank you very, see you.
this is also part of soda. You know, it is a rock that is surely underneath, that is harvested from underneath. It is very, very, very hard. In fact, I can't even lift this. You can see my hand. I cannot even take. No, I can, I can take a bit. So it looks like this. So it is harvested from underground. It's kind of rock. Yeah. So that is how it looks like. Even here looks like like stones, but it's uh, this uh, same soda ash. Then it's graded, becomes even like sand, and then becomes soft for. Then it's taken to the factory to be pro processed. There is even a very big, huge lorry coming here that carries this soda ash. <laughs>